Hi guys, have you ever wanted to create your own Chrome extension but didn't know where to start? Imagine being able to add new features to your browser and get things done quicker. By creating your own Chrome extension, you can take control of your browser and make it work the way you want. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can use ChatGPT to create a fully functioning Chrome extension and whether you're a beginner or have some coding experience, this tutorial will guide you through the process step by step. So I'm Brian from Upset Learners and let's get started. First, let's talk about what a Chrome extension is and why you might want to create one. A Chrome extension is a small software program that customizes your browsing experience in the Google Chrome web browser. It can add new features, modify web pages, or perform action based on certain events. Okay, we're going to create a Chrome extension in just two steps. The first step is to create the files needed for the extension. And we're going to use ChatGPT to create the files for our extension. And with these files, we can launch the extension on the Chrome browser. So to create the files needed for our extension, let's go to ChatGPT. I'm switching to GPT-4, which has a feature to create files in just one click. Okay, now we need to enter a prompt to create our files. I've already prepared a prompt to get all the files in just one click. You can just copy the prompt from the description below. And then paste it here. Now here, enter what your extension is about and how it should work. I want to create a YouTube bookmark extension and with this extension, whenever I watch a YouTube video, I want to be able to bookmark it or save any specific point. And later, if I open it, I want the video to play from that specific point that I had saved. So I'm going to enter all the explanation here and make sure to clearly describe all the features you need and how it should work. Now here, give a name for your extension. And once you've typed in the prompt, just press enter and there you go. ChatGPT has started the code for us and it has created the files needed for our extension. So let's go ahead and download it. Open it. Now if we right click and extract it. You can see that we've got the files needed for our extension. And once you've got the files, let's go to step 2, which is to upload the extension files to Google Chrome. So to upload it, just click on the extensions button, click manage extensions. Now here, enable developer mode and click load unpacked. Then select the extension folder we downloaded and click select. As you can see, our extension is added here. But right now, it is inactive. That is because we have some errors here. So let's click here. And you can see it's saying we've got these errors on our files. Now sometimes you might get errors like these. And to make our extension work, we need to fix the errors. Don't worry, it's very easy. We can simply ask ChatGPT to resolve these errors and give us the updated file. So to do that, we can just copy the errors like this. Go back to ChatGPT and paste them here. Now let's tell ChatGPT to solve these errors and provide the updated files. Now press enter. It has fixed the errors and generated the updated file. So let's download it and extract the file. Once we've got the new files, we need to replace it in our extension folder. So let's copy it. Now go to the extension folder we have downloaded earlier. Then paste the updated file. And click replace. Okay, now that we updated the new files in our extension, let's check if there are any errors resolved. Go to the extension page. Now go back. And if we click refresh, you can see that we are still getting an error. And this time it's saying that the icon file could not be loaded. Now if we check the extension files, you can see we have the file called icon. Now an icon is the image that appears on your extension like this. And this one is a random icon that ChatGPT has created for our extension. 
To fix this issue, we need to add our own icon for the extension. Now, if you already have an icon, you can replace this file with your own icon. But make sure you name it as icon.png. If you don't have an icon, you can simply search on the internet to find one. So I'm going to search for YouTube icons. Similarly, you can search for the icon you want. Right click on the image and click save image as. Go to the extensions folder and here we have the old icon. To replace the new icon, here enter icon.png, click save and click yes to replace. Okay, so now we've added the icon and all the errors should be fixed. To check it, let's go back and if we click retry, you can see our extension is active and if we go to this extension icon, you can see our extension has been successfully added to Chrome. Now we can pin the extension to access it easily and if we click on it, this is how our extension looks like. Okay, once we got the extension, let's check if it's working. I'll go to a YouTube video and play it. Hi guys, so in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can make your own AI. Now I want to bookmark this video at this specific time. So let's open the extension and click on save current timestamp. Now anytime later, if I go to the extension and reopen the bookmark that I said before, so just drag and drop the audio here. Let's listen to it. You can see the video plays from that specific timestamp. Now we have successfully added the Chrome extension and this is how it looks. So let's say you want to change the appearance and make it look more attractive. We can do that too with the help of ChatGPT. Just describe how you want the extension to look like. You can mention the color scheme and the style of the buttons you want. So once you've entered that, press enter and ChatGPT will generate the file for the new look of our extension. So let's download it. Move it to the extensions folder. And click replace. All right, now that we have replaced the old file, let's see how it works. So let's click on the extension. And there you go. We have a new attractive extension. So that's it guys. This is how you can create a Chrome extension using ChatGPT. And not just that, ChatGPT can help you create more incredible things. If you want to learn how to create an entire website just by using AI, you can check out this video. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Website Learners for more cool videos like this one. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Until then, take care. Bye-bye.